bit of money. Okay, so we're going to build an ant rack now for this. Uh, we're taking the bolts out. There's these two little hook things that were there. We're going to use two of those bolts to hold the ant rack, which will, you won't see them, but it'll also hold the sub at the same time from sliding. So that'll be the whole holding system. So we'll take the last one out. Cool. And uh, over here, designing. So it's going to look like that. It's only 48 centimeters wide. So anyway, cut up all his wood. Here it is, the MDF itself. So it's going to sit like that okay now I can't do more of an angle because well that's as angled as I can actually do so it's gonna actually be that high but anyway so we're just putting the holes in for the screws for the triangles and then there's the holes for the bolts in the back and then that's it here we go there's a rack like that as you can see I put two screws in I'll do two more and we've got a angle and we've got the triangles and that's how it sits it's like huge gap at the back because the sub is gonna stick to about there type of thing, I left a huge gap because I don't want it hitting it or anything. Anyway, uh, so I cut the sides out in there, as you can see, got the holes for the box. And then there's the front. Cool. Got the front on it there. Perfectly joined. It's a nice front on it. And, uh, yeah. Okay, anyway. Not painting it or anything like that. Just going to put it in the car. There's the bolts. They look kind of shit, but it doesn't really matter because there's lots of washers and nuts, but it's not going anywhere. Here you go, Alex. Good. Sit that there. Yeah, and that's how the amp will look, but we're going to screw that on. We're going to pull the sub box back, and I'll show you, and then we'll have a little demo. Is that, is that in? Look at that. It literally can't move at all. Now, even if it bounces up, you know what I mean? Because, like, it's only a little bit holding it, Matt. If it bounces up, it's uh, it can only slide forward. Hold that, you're gonna hold the camera just there. It can only slide forward to the bolts, you know what I mean? Which aren't gonna hit the actual woofer, but it'll still won't hit this. So nothing it can do will result in it hitting the amp, the will sub hit the amp. Okay. Beautiful. What do you want me to put on? Just anything. Something basic. My level. Okay. Up to you. Wires just going around right in the back there. Might zip tie it for you to get just to make sure they don't move. Say it, Joe. Later, oh. I take them out, pour shots of liquor. As I said, people, it's not centered because the sub's obviously not centered because of the port. That's finished now. There's not really anything left to do as far as the sub and amp go, bar if Matt wanted to paint it, but I wouldn't really bother. He'll probably end up doing something better in the future. And front speakers will do in this and a head unit maybe in the future, nearer future too. Cool. Now we'll go on to my full drive. <laughs> That's four wheel. Whoa, That's so much better. <laughs> That's so much better, Matt. It's yeah. faster. Holy shit. It's so much cooler. Dude, that would look so good on video. Look at the angle. Yes! <laughs> You're going good. <laughs>